I'm going to be showing you guys how you can actually make millions per day in GTA 5 Online. So of course, just getting started with this, as you guys may or may not know it, but Rockstar Games does a weekly update, and with that, they make some of the adversary modes double money in RP, or triple money in RP for this week. And one of these is actually going to be triple money in RP on the adversary mode at Kill Quota. So of course, we will be taking advantage of that, and the good thing about this adversary mode is that it unlocks at level 1. So of course, the first thing you want to do is make your way into any GTA Online session. You can be an invite only or a public, it honestly doesn't matter. And then from here, what you want to go ahead and do is just press options, go to online, go to jobs, and this is where you can choose between click join or play job. So if you guys actually have someone to do this with, then go over to play job, go over to Rockstar Created, head over to reversary mode, and just keep on going until you find kill quota. So kill quota is actually, there's seven of them that you can choose from, and it's troll money and RP for this week. Now you do need another player in order to start it up, and if you guys don't have anyone to do this with, then go back over to hear it, go over to quick join, go over to play adversary mode, and then what it's going to do is try to link you up with any group who's starting any adversary mode up. And the good thing is because it's troll money and RP for this week, a lot of people are actually doing this. And so you can see here, I went right into a group with three other players, and it looks like we're doing number seven, funny enough. Oh no, not uh, number four, sorry. And so now we're going to go ahead and see if we can get more players. So how this adversary mode works is very similar to the gun game if you guys ever played Call of Duty. What happens is whenever you spawn in, your team actually gets a certain gun. What happens is that you have to kill the enemy team and each time you get a kill, it actually goes upgraded to one for that next weapon. And so of course you have to get four kills in total for your team in order to switch to the next weapon. And you just want to keep on switching weapons. Until you get to the highest one whenever you actually have the time run out. Or if you actually get to the very end, which is going to be the pool queue. And you kill a player with that, then you automatically win that round. And of course, vice versa for the enemy team. And that's how the entire adversary mode works. Okay, and I think we actually won this round. And yes, we did win. So let's go and see what we got for this one. This one's actually a very, very long adversary mode. So it looks like we got $44,780 as well as $6,750 RP. As for the opponent's team, one did leave, but they got $22,390 and only $3,376 RP. Now, do keep in mind your RP is going to change depending on the amount of kills that you get, because every kill that you get gives you around 125 RP per kill. Are you wanting more money in GTA 5 Online, but don't want to spend the ridiculous price of shark cards? I mean, just look at these prices. You want a new car? That's $50. You want the Oppressor MK2, that's $100. And if you want some of the nicest vehicles in the game, you're looking at between $50 to $100 in just shark cards. That's more than just buying the game itself. Thankfully, this is where OP Mods comes in. They feature cheap and reliable services for your GTA 5 online needs. They provide modded accounts and boost the game, so instead of spending a $100 shark card, you can spend $15 and get $150 million there. They currently have this available to all the old gen and next gen consoles, including PC. Thankfully to their new update that they just added on the website, looking for what you need is much easier and more simplified. Aside from GTA, they also have Red Dead Redemption 2 as well as Forza Horizon 5 mods. With Red Dead Redemption 2, you can get a gold boost, cash boost, or even modded accounts. Right now, there is a summer sale available with up to 60% off on purchases. So what are you waiting for? Go buy it now, and also don't forget to use code LEGIT for 5% off on all your purchases. Thank you, and now let's get on with the video. And it looks like we just won the entire game because of the fact that we had the pool queue, which is the last weapon that you have. So let's go and see what we got in total for this. So it looks like we got 44000 $780 and only 6,750 RP. And as for the opponent team, they got around $23,390 and 3,376 RP. Now, do keep in mind that the RP is going to change depending on how many kills you get because each kill is 125 RP. And for some reason, the RP for the kills does not add in the end total. So you got to go ahead and do that yourself. So now we're going to go ahead and move on to the next round. And there we go, so it looks like we may have just won the entire match here. Wow, okay, it is still another round. I'm guessing they set it to four rounds, which is honestly really good. I'm happy to see that. 
Uh, but I was not expecting the person to set it to four rounds. So it looks like for this one, we got $44,780. Basically the same amount, but the RP did change to around $6,750. Yeah. And I think that was our final match for this entire game. And it looks like it actually is. So let's go and see what we got for this. We got $328,350 and $33,750 RP. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I think that is the most amount of money I've ever made playing GTA Online for an adversary mode. That is a ton of money and a lot more RP than I was expecting. And I believe it even added up the RP we got for the kills. So let's go and see what the end total was. So it looks like for the opponent team, they only got around 29k and 4,500 RP. Now for us, for winning the round, we got 60,000, which actually looks like the limit for it. And around 2,000 RP for completing it. And there you guys go. That is basically your RP method this week. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to leave a like and subscribe for more GTA 5 videos and content like this. Now, before I do go ahead and end the video, I would like to first go ahead and talk about our GTA 5 money account giveaway I am doing on this channel. So let me go ahead and switch that now. Just a quick announcement before in the video. I am doing a modded account giveaway for PlayStation 5, the Xbox Series X and S, as well as the Xbox One players. In order to actually be entered into the giveaway, the first thing you need to do is like this video and subscribe to this channel. After that, you want to go to this email right here and for the subject type GTA 5 modded account. After that, you are entered in, and the giveaway winner will be announced on December 2nd, so there you guys go. With that being said, you guys have a great one, stay safe out there, and goodbye.